Well, we've arrived at Karina Williams. Um, that sign on the right hand side says the new vicarage. And this will be Karina Williams' home for the next few years. But that is not. The um, blue covering is what is left to be picked up of their boxes. Karen reckons that's only about 20%. There's their caravan, little car that we've got, and Karen's car, and then this is the the house. On the right hand side they have a double garage, then the kitchen and Anna's bedroom, or part of Anna's bedroom is above the kitchen. On the left hand side you can see William's study, and then they have four bedrooms on the second floor. Williams trailer. Apparently it's been given a good workout this last week. And then we come to the front door. So that window there is the kitchen into William's study. So the parishioners can see that William is hard at work. We'll go in and have a look. Someone might even recognize this. <coughs> Let me just close the front door. This is the uh, vestibule. Uh, goes through to the main part of the house and upstairs. I'm guessing some of this furniture many may well recognize. Through to a bathroom. Nice bathroom. Bathroom, pretty much like many bathrooms. Big mirror. <coughs> yes, I managed to pick up a bit of a cold. I will live. So this is William's office, obviously the uh, printer for doing all of the parish newspapers. Beautiful office. It makes me very jealous. He's got the polished floorboards. Great chair. Nice deep desk. Plenty of storage underneath. Printers and computers everywhere. My bed for the night. Lovely racks. Again, a bit like mine, but not... Mine's not quite as nice. And then some cupboard space. Go back through the vestibule. Oh, those doors go through to the kitchen. But we'll go into the main hallway and then through to the kitchen. No, they don't go through to the kitchen, they go to a um, cupboard. Another computer, it's more like a family one that everybody hops on, including Liv and Alex. Massive, great, lovely kitchen again with the um, Polish boards. Apparently it's about twice the size of the other one and I can see that this will very much become a focal point for the family. Obviously having only been here two weeks they're still in the process of settling in. They did a massive turf of everything when they left. And then when they got here they realised that they had yet more that they could get rid of. Big fridge freezer in the laundry. I haven't yet been outside but we will go out there later. Going through to a more formal dining room. Sure. Lots and lots of family photos, and I even recognise some of the people in them. So this is a more formal dining room, really nicely done up. Piano, Joe plays, amongst others. Again, lots and lots of mirrors. 
Uh, there's a particular mirror I do need to show you upstairs. <laughs> then through to formal sitting room with a nice, really nice open fire that is going to be <coughs> I'm sure we'll get an absolute caning during the, during the winter months we've got a number of sets of doors that open out onto the patio I haven't yet worked out quite how to do all of this so My God, my trumpet. My trumpet, no less. My candlesticks. There's two of them. <laughs> Going up the stairs. It's so airy in here. There's windows and mirrors everywhere. It's really, really good. On the left, we have Joe's room. Hello. All of his musical instruments. And do you play the trumpet at all? Do you play my trumpet at all? Um. It's my trumpet. That one is. I played that once. Really? Yeah, and I could play it as well. I'm not sure I could play it anymore. But. I'm not sure if it's battery or quite well. This is Anna's room. Next room along. It smells very much of joysticks, as you would expect. But what she's done is she's gone and turned the dressing room into her bedroom. And this gets my vote. So it's nice and dark and hopefully quiet. I hope it doesn't get cold for her. She's actually out at the cinema at the moment. Walking through to the main bathroom. That's right at the top of the stairs. A nice shower over bath, as they say. Onto the guest room, which is where Alex and Olivia are. Say hello. Party in the guest room. Okay. Alex and Liv will be spending the night here. Liv will be spending two nights here. Alex is going to come up with me to see Nana and Grandad. Yay! Right. And then the master bedroom. Which is Karen and Wills. It has its own on the suite and whilst there's that mirror this is the mirror I particularly like now I believe that if I can stand in the right spot there we go you can't possibly call me fat see there's nothing there and that is a tour of the inside of the house a very quick one